I'm about to react to a channel that I've never heard of, that nobody recommended, that I've never seen, and that I've never come across. Do you know why? Because there ain't nothing else to react to. Listen, there's some days that, you know, they ain't shit to watch, okay? There just isn't. I scroll down my subscriptions, and if there's nothing that I'm interested in reacting to, I ain't gonna react to it. I usually will skip a day. But, because this is gonna be my last day to react to something before my Florida trip, I gotta react to something. I can't leave you guys empty-handed, you get what I'm saying? So, I'm gonna go ahead and react to Cassie Mua, or Cassie M-U-A. I don't know, don't know who the fuck this person is, but the profile picture is, looks like a woman. They have 191,000 subscribers, and this video is called Blacking Out in Miami. My coworker and I were going to Orlando, Florida, but I wanna see how it is in Miami. I wanna see how they get down, so let's go ahead and watch this video. Hi everyone, my name is Gabriel Zamora, and I still don't know who's camera I'm using. Okay, his name sounds familiar. Gabriel some more. Mm. <laughs> um, we are headed to the beach. Strip club, you're That's lying good. to them. Everybody wants to go to the strip club, but I just want to go to the beach. We're actually going no. to the nude beach. If I want to. Ooh, down for a nude beach we moment. Yes, the video was telling us we should go. Laura, I a, need nude to see beach? You at the a nude beach. Let me give you a tour as to who's in our car. <laughs> Okay, so first we have Vic Too Tall. Hello. Oh, so, okay, first of all, I'm so happy that you're gonna be introducing everyone to us. Thank you so much. Weirdly enough, he fits, but we have the sunroof <laughs> just in case his head needs to pop up for him, right? Okay, then we have El Diana. Hi, El Diana. El Diana is our designated driver. That's what's up. He's basically. Make sure whenever you're out, you designate someone to drive because if all of you are gonna drink, you might as well take an Uber, okay? Your designated, like, responsible person, except for last night. Yeah, what oh. happened last night? Yeah. What happened last night? Someone took all the shots. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Elden was our honorary, like, let's He's not waste so the shots. <laughs> okay, next up we have Jesus. Hi, everyone. How are you feeling, everyone? Okay, Jesus. He's short, small, colored. He's got to be Hispanic. <laughs> Tired. Tired La Casa, did you turn up last night? Oh, did. Do you remember last night? <laughs> okay, now we have... <gasps> did you get a nose job? Yeah, what? Oh, wow. Snatched. Who is she? It's so small right now, guys, because I can't stop drinking. Oh, me. But it's so snatched for it to be swollen, so you know it's gonna get even more snatched than it already is. Wow, love that for you, Miss Boutique. And then... What do you, the world, think about plastic surgery. Should people do it to enhance their looks? In my opinion, do whatever the fuck you want. It's your body, your money, your life. As for me, I like the more natural look, you know? I prefer seeing a woman in their natural habitat. But that's just my opinion. And here we have Miss Cassie Mua. Cassie. Oh, okay, so this is Cassie Mua. This is her channel. The most quietest one in the fucking car. <laughs> this is her channel. So who the hell is Gabriel, the one that's holding the camera? I think he's more entertaining. She just woke up like five minutes ago. Still trying to come alive, to be honest. Last but certainly not least, hi, my name is Gabriel. <laughs> you already, um, you already I deserve two yourself. intros. I deserve an intro and an outro. <laughs> All right, boy, you're more entertaining, so I might have to find you after this video, but... Let's keep watching. Um, yeah, this is the outro to my initial intro, you guys. Um, yeah, I'm feeling real tan, feeling real cute. Um, and yeah, that's all I can really request. I took some candy earlier, so we're about to find out how Gabriel's gonna be in like probably like 30 minutes. And edible? Yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna get fucked up on the beach, and then that's the transition to me like. Ah, go ahead. I'm, when I go this weekend, it's supposed to be like in the 70s. Returning Not the too hot, but still okay. Got the whole damn crew, okay. Damn, y'all went with a big ass group. I got a This looks questionable with the chili flakes. It was really craving tahini, but I don't know if it's like Yeah. 
So from what it looks like, this looks like a whole Hispanic crew, which of course I don't mind because I'm Mexican myself. But um, I, it looks like they got money. I don't know if it's from YouTube or from any other businesses or from their parents, their family, their family's wealth, I don't know. But uh, yeah, let's, let's keep watching. <laughs> Turned up right now. For real. <laughs> Why are you guys so down? No vibes right here. I got mom. Let's go. Can we go to the club? Okay, I'm coming. On my way. <laughs> Gotta get them shots in. Gotta get them shots in. Get the party started. Look at y'all. <laughs> Okay, got that cigar. Okay. Get some shots in. I'm telling you. I'm gonna take a couple shots, and I'm not a shot type of person. I'm not a liquor person. I'm more of a beer type of gal. But, uh, you know, it's for my birthday weekend celebration. That's how I'm considering it to be. So I'm gonna have a good time. Uh. I don't do tequila. I'm not doing tequila. Getting Monday started off Okay, got some hot tub vibes. Again with the shots, you know. Gotta hype it up a little bit for the night. That's what I wanna do, you see that? When you have a whole group of friends rent out, I'm assuming an Airbnb. It's just a big party, just for the weekend. You know, that's all you need is just for the weekend. That looks like a good time. And you know, I'm gonna tell you, I'm about to be 35 years old and it's been about five to six years that I've really like partied, like partied. So it's gonna be fun and interesting. Oh hell no. Elvin is the fastest ever. Period. Damn. This is how it's going on, Daddy. That's crazy. I oh, he didn't finish it. <laughs> he couldn't finish it. Hey, leave my man alone. That was my good doing. That was weak. Who's gonna say so? Who this is? She said TikTok. Oh god. <laughs> Oh. You made the face. Wow, you guys made that look very interesting. <laughs> Y'all should have hyped that part up. Cass is recording for on her Snapchat and then we also on. My mom. She said bartender. Bartender. I'm not trying to like over record. Oh. You guys are taking too many shots. A bitch. <laughs> Get the party started now. Everybody's in their fits. They're tipsy. They're ready. There's a lot of plastic surgery in that room. <laughs> There's a lot of plastic going on in that room. I ain't judging though. It's just an observation. I 
wonder what kind of music they're really dancing to because this music that they're using is actually um, from the YouTube creator studio. So this is not what they're dancing to. But I'm curious to know what kind of shit y'all get down with. <laughs> That's the guy that's gonna end up being so fucked up, has to leave the club early, throw up on his way back home, and knock the fuck out. That's the guy. That's <laughs> There's always that one person, and he's that person. <laughs> They are so gone. You guys. Oh. <laughs> I remember my days. Listen, when I was y'all age, in my early 20s, I would get so fucked up too. Because you don't really know your tolerance yet. You're still like, uh, what's the word? You're still experimenting, you know, with different alcohols, different liquors, different beer. And you're trying to really get a hold of your consumption of what you can really handle, what your body can handle. So y'all don't know it yet. <laughs> you guys do not know it from what it seems like. You haven't even left the house to get to the club yet. And this girl's already gone. You can see it in her face. Her eyes is like, she's blacking out right now. Like, she's not gonna remember this part. Look at her eyes. Look at her eyes. She's gone, yo. She's gone. <laughs> Ooh, girl, don't spend too much. Don't spend too much. Again with this TikTok shit. Aren't you the one <laughs> that was already blacked out? Girl, you're about to drink again? Oh, hell no. Nah. funny because most of the time you just drink just to start to just to get the party started for social reasons pre-gaming and then you start getting some pressure like once a, one person is like okay let's take a shot it's like you kind of have to because everyone else is doing it <laughs> and then the more people keep announcing let's take a shot let's take a shot <laughs> you're gonna be wasted man <laughs> Look at y'all, they're still taking shots. It's crazy. Okay, so now they're at the club. All right, this can't be no strip club because at the strip club, you're not allowed to dance because then you're taking away the attention from the girls. So they must be at a nightclub. Oh, shit. <laughs> hey. Why not dance with them, you know? Gotta dance with them since they're not, that's all they're doing right now is just playing music. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> okay, girl. Get it. Get it. What kind of vlog this is cuz so far half of the video has been taking shots drinking 
getting fucked up, <laughs> dancing. It looks like a good time, don't get me wrong, it does look like a good time, but I don't know, man. I don't know. Well, let's keep watching and let's see what happens. Gone. Oh, he took off his glasses. do realize, I think those were just go-go dancers, you guys do realize that this is probably hours of partying, like non-stop. I guess that's how it is in Miami. I've never been, so. If you've been in Miami, comment below, let me know how your experience was. Maybe one day I'll go. Hey, what the fuck? That's my purple hair. Oh. Yeah. Chicken some good old food after the club just hits the spot everything tastes so much better when you're drunk and wasted damn they're crazy look at that shit it's our last night in miami and we are coming to top golf with the squad are you ready to hit some balls no so today was recovery day because last night guys Blacked out. Like, obviously, I don't even know what happened, a lot of you guys blacked out. Like, I probably took like 20 shots. And yeah. A, it's a Monday night. B, it was spontaneous. Chill, like, you know, like get lit, but like kind of chill. I got so fucked up that I was throwing <laughs> up my brains all night long. Obviously. And I spent the entire day sleeping, and now we are finally making a move. It is like 10 o'clock. And we came to Top Golf. Y'all already know we are not going to be hitting any balls, not those kind of balls. But we're here for more support. And I might start editing this video, period. How's the ball hitting going? Not well. Not well? No. Oh no. All of our food just arrived. I would not be able to do much right after a night of partying. I've gotten to the age where I can't handle my shit no more. Like I literally need a whole day to recover, like at home in bed. Day in Miami, we're about to head out, but not before getting the drone footage. Of course we, we as in you, wait till the last minute. <laughs> Me, 
What are you doing? What's your calibre doing? I was gonna say, are they gay? Period. Miami girls. I'm oh, literally so hungover. Should we kiss? And just so you know, this is a Bruce from filler. None. Oh. Nothing else. I don't like to see that. Period. <laughs> saying that you guys I understand there's some terms in every generation some slang that in every generation everyone's got to say but that whole period shit is so annoying you guys said period like 50 times in this video please stop <laughs> okay cheers this is me drinking it <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, someone's throwing up. Who is it? Oh, okay. Never mind. Listen, you guys are bogus. You guys are, you guys are so wrong for that. You know your friend is so fucked up and so gone and she's talking about her pussy being out and she didn't, she's half dressed, okay? Like, anything can slip out at this moment. And instead of helping her, well, this guy's helping, but I don't know what his intentions are behind that because, you know, some guys take advantage of the situation. But you guys decide to take out the camera and just film her. Like, come on, what kind of friends are you guys? I swear, I'm telling you. Social media is fun and everything, but then people are starting to make prioritize that over friendships and relationships. Let's watch that again. Look. Instead of helping her, look at they decided to film. Gabby! I You guys. Oh, that's her man. Okay, good. You guys finally helped her out. So I'm assuming this is her channel. This is Cassie Mua, whatever the fuck. Okay, so I'm gonna stop the video here and I will say this. Cassie, I just will not be subscribing to this channel. It's not my thing. Out of this 18 minute video, I would say a good 
12 minutes of it was you guys just drinking. There was no content behind that. There was no story behind it. It's just you guys filming, which is fun. It's good. But that you could just keep to yourself with you and your friends. You don't really have to put it on social media like that because there was nothing unique about that. You know, make it make it interesting. Make the make the vlog a little bit more interesting. What do you think I should do on my weekend trip? It's just gonna be me and my coworker. Should I film? Should I vlog it? I'm debating. I'm thinking about just escaping for the weekend and just enjoying every second of the day. Or should I film a little bit of it? Because I do love to edit and I do like to show you guys what I'm up to. Comment below, let me know what I should do. All right, you guys, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and please hit that bell so you can get notified every time I upload. See you in the next video. Peace.